G'day Carbonites, Timmy Carbon, back with some more ARK Survival Evolved No Flyer campaign. So I've been doing some farming uh, in between episodes. I grabbed a um, male Dilo, we've got a male and female Paki, and a uh, male and female Parasaur as well, just for the eggs. And the egg and poop collector has been going off the chain. So that's really good. This thing can't keep up with how much poo and uh, thatch it's getting. <laughs> but we do have uh, quite a bit of fertilizer. Uh, 43. So we'll be able to start um, farming veggies pretty soon, I think. Um, I made these little... Uh, they're called lockers. But they're basically just a, a miniature vault that... Um, goes up against the wall. Um, it has 50 slots, so they're a third of the size of, uh, of a proper vault. Um, and they're, they're still pretty expensive. Uh, I think they were like 200 metal each. I made two of them. I've got one down here. I don't have any anything in this one just yet. Um, but they, they're really cool. They, um, they snap to the wall and um, you can probably fit three across a wall so yeah they're pretty cool I like them so I also set up my uh, patreon wall these are the uh, supporters I have on patreon basically anyone that supports me um, I put their name up on the wall so I've finally set that up so thank you very much guys I appreciate it the link for my patreon is um, in the description below so you can check out the page if you want don't feel like you have to though it's um, completely optional I've made a um, a saddle for the trike it was um, a stamina one yeah stamina oh it's apprentice we we unlocked um, the apprentice ones and it's got this yellow glow to it and it goes like all through the horns and stuff it looks really really cool Yeah, I think it's really cool. I like it. Um, okay, so this episode, I want to make um, like a raft or something. Like, I, I want a, a mobile base that we can take out. So when we go exploring, um, we can camp out. We, we don't need to come all the way back to base. So... Okay, so I've got the big wooden raft. Um, I don't actually know how big this is. Uh, and then we have this um, dino transport barge as well. So I'd like to place this. I think this one is just going to be like a... Like the, the model has just been made bigger. But this one looks like it's a new model. So um, we just need 250 polymer, 200 cement paste and 200 metal ingots. Which we should be able to get from the fabricator. So there's the metal, polymer, cementing paste. Alright, so let's make that. I should put those eggs in the um, in the dry store as well. Once again, thunderstorm while I'm recording. <laughs> Alright, so let's have a look at this. Holy shit. That thing is massive. Oh, that's awesome. That's way bigger than I thought it was going to be. How do I drive it? This thing's huge. There it is. Wow. <laughs> this thing is massive. That's awesome.
Okay, this this is going to be good. I mean, we'll be able to make a really decent base on here. And we'll still have room to uh, transport dinos as well. Okay, so I think this episode we'll just... Um, we'll start building our base on here. Okay, so they snap... directly on top of it. Okay, so none of these things block your movement. That's good. Okay, that looks pretty good. Okay, so we can do this trick where we lower the foundation by using a series of pillars and ceilings. So, uh, Monkey Puzzle actually told me about it. So, if we keep doing this, so if we extend the ceiling back over this way, then use another pillar. Hmm, it might not do it with the corrected structures. I know what it is. It's because this is the uh, same height from the previous one. So let's get rid of this. And get rid of this one as well. Yeah, that's better. Okay, so then we can... get rid of the pillar. And these ceilings. And we'll get rid of this foundation as well. Okay, so pillar. I don't think we need to do another one. Let's just go across with two ceilings. Put another pillar in there. There we go. Now we got it. Okay, that's that's pretty low, but I just I want to see what one more looks like. That's like perfect. It's pretty close. One more. Okay. That's what one more looks like. It's pretty good. Um... go out this way. I just want to see what it looks like on here. Yeah, you can see through the all the slats. It's not really what I want. I'd prefer this one, I think. Alright, we're going to need a lot more foundations. Alright, cool. Well, I'm going to do that, and I'll see you guys soon. Okay, so we're back, and I sort of went a little bit overboard. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Uh, so I placed down all the foundations and then started building and thought, hey, oh, you should probably start recording this. So I'll um, show you what I've done. I went through so many foundations. There's, there's over a hundred here. Probably close to two hundred. 
so I'm thinking like I've got this picture on my head of like a container ship where they have like the cockpit area and like you know the the bridge and everything at the back here and then it's just all flat and open down the front for all the containers so we could store all our dinos at the front so I'm probably gonna have ramps down here and same on the other side and then down here I'm gonna have some steps so we can um, yeah so we can walk up looks pretty cool I've put like little um, like it's all sealed underneath I got um, ceilings and then I've got the um, sloped walls just to tidy it all up and uh, yeah then we've got some angled uh, dino gates for I don't know a little bit of a variation in the shape uh, I thought it looked pretty cool so I want to cover this up um, but due to the like the length of the dino gates it's not going to be yeah like it's it's going to be hard to place walls there so I guess I could use um, fence foundations if I could get it to snap yeah in in the middle of those two foundations right there <laughs> That's actually pretty good. That's facing the wrong way though, isn't it? Damn it. <laughs> okay, is that going to be... Is that going to do what I want it to do though? Look at it spazzing out. Jesus. <laughs> no, it's not going to be long enough. No, nah, that's, uh, that's dodgy. I'm not doing that. Okay, I've got some half walls. I wonder if we could use these somehow. Maybe go from the top. If we could... Okay, we can put a pillar there. Oh, what the... There's two snap points there. Let's let's go with the higher one <laughs> to see where that takes us. All right, so I'll take pillars up. That's that's fairly close. <laughs> I can't I can't really see, but it's not too bad. All right, let's take that across, and then we'll go down with pillars. Yeah, that, that lines up pretty good. Um, that's actually... <laughs> that's going to be exactly the same as having those walls. Uh, do we have any wide... Double door frames. Alright, I'm going to get some double door frames. We'll be back in a sec. Okay, so. Oh, that's obviously not going to work there. <laughs> we'll have to go from the top down. Um, Alright, let's... Um, let's do that. And then we'll do one of those. And then one of those. So we've got like a little window at the back. And then one of those. Ah, oh, shit. Um, we won't be able to put a door there. Um, because we'll have to remove this. And if we remove that, then it's going to fall.
What the f... <laughs> no. Oh, it's getting dark. Yeah, okay, that worked. All right, I'm gonna get some doors. Beautiful, okay, so that's good, I like it. Um, now we just gotta replace that wall. All right, we should be able to get rid of this. Beautiful. Okay, so that's looking pretty good. Now we can get these um, fence foundations in here so we can do some windows. Uh, I think we'll just go solid. Uh, actually, no. Oh, damn it. Don't snap to that. Yeah, just... Whoa, hey. Yeah, we'll take it all the way. That looks good. I'm going to have to find a way to get up there. To get rid of that other one. I think what we might have to do is... Somehow, put some pillars in here. To, to block that um, hole. It's a shame about the, the corner of the ceiling there as well. Really sucks. I might be better off just doing the um, the dino gate there. The dino gate was a little bit off, like it um, it didn't cover the whole sp the whole um, length of it. Which was why I wanted to go with this way, but this isn't going the whole length either, so we may as well use these. There you go. Yeah, see what I mean? Like it's... On this side there's a fairly big gap. You guys probably can't see because it's actually pretty dark and I shouldn't be recording at this time. Yeah, so that side's perfect because that's the side it snapped to. But this side, because it doesn't come over far enough, there's going to be that gap there. But I could, I could probably find a way to fit some pillars in there, which would cover it up. And then we can get rid of the all these half walls and stuff like that and just do um, something like this. But we'll put some doors or something down the bottom. Okay, so I'm going to unlock the um, temporary building stuff. So um, this stuff's really cheap and it's designed to um, to like just be uh, like a test placement. And then after you get your layout all worked out, then you replace it with the, the stuff that you actually wanted. But I, I'm thinking about using it as just... Um, like uh, scaffolding because it's it's really cheap to make um, now you can't like use this as your base uh, material because what they did is see how the health is only one so they they break really easily okay so you can't pick it up but yeah I can punch it and it'll break so um, yeah it's not not designed as a final base all right, I think I'll wait for the sun to come up a bit more. It's only 6 a.m. at the moment, and then we'll get back into building. Okay, so we're back. I uh, did some dodgy scaffolding. I fixed up that uh, window up the top there. And I've placed the uh, wide, tall gate. I had to actually remove the dino gate first to to get it to work, but it looks it looks pretty good. There's there's still that gap there, but I'm pretty sure we can fix that with pillars. Hopefully, anyway. Might have to remove the gate again. 
Uh, let's let's put them there. Yeah. Okay. So that snap point there. That should be the fence foundation. Actually, it looks like it's a couple. Okay, that one is for the other fence foundation. Actually, where's the middle of the... Because there's a snap point in the middle of the foundation. Okay, there's a snap point in between as well. So that's why we're getting those two snap points very close to each other. But either way, we need to remove the... Oh, I think it's the dino gate that's blocking it. Actually, now that I look at that, it's probably the door frame. Alright, we'll get rid of that as well. There we go. Okay, is it because of this? Let's get rid of that. Damn it, there's something blocking it. Could be the other dino gate. Alright, let's try it. Oh, it's going to be those walls. God damn it. Um, Alright. <laughs> Screw it. I'm just going to pick them up. Okay. And we don't want that angled one. That angled one's off the other foundation. Okay, that should be right. Now that we've demolished everything we've created, we should be able to uh, rebuild it. Okay, dino gate. Beautiful. Now, how does that look? That's pretty good. And this side? Not too bad. Yep, pretty happy with that. Okay, guys, that's going to be it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. Next episode, we're going to do a building montage of the uh, container ship or, I don't know, whatever you want to call it. So, as always, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Don't forget to lead your targets, and I'll see you next time.